Good morning guys. I look like a little troll because I'm about to start working out. It actually isn't the morning. I don't know why I'm saying good morning. Um, it is noon and I'm going to start working out. I am doing the Alexis Ren butt, beach butt workout and her ab workout. I've been doing it for two days now and it freaking hurts. I am so sore but it is working I think. I do see a pump in my booty when I'm done. I'm gonna start working out and as for this water bottle I get so many questions um, about it. I got it off of Amazon. I'm gonna try to link it down below if it's still in stock but I really do like it. It is secure. You open it and it has a straw. You can use the straw or you can't. It's it really doesn't matter it's up to your preferences um but yeah i'm gonna start working out i am intermittent fasting i start eating around noon and stop eating at 8 p.m but yesterday i started eating at 1 p.m and i didn't stop eating till 9 p.m so today i'm gonna start doing that again i'm not gonna eat until one because of yesterday so i just adjust my schedule depending on how i'm doing the fasting and depending on when i eat because i don't have a set schedule um but i'm gonna try to get on one but yeah i hope you guys enjoy this little vlog i do have a few updates for you and all of that but i'm not gonna talk your ear off in the intro i'm gonna start working out and then we'll have breakfast and do all of that so yeah let's get on <laughs> Um, but as you saw while I was working out, I got 
my groceries delivered to me because it's hard to go grocery shopping now um, during these times but also um, having a puppy because I am too afraid to leave him alone in the car I'm too afraid to leave him alone at the house and I don't want to be dropping him off at my mom's house every single time I'm going out um, although she does not mind let's do a quick grocery haul I got this raw shrimp tail off peeled and deveined I got some ham cage free eggs cauliflower pepper jack cheese Jasmine rice, five pounds of it. Red onion, a white onion, some baby carrots, bell peppers, some romaine hearts, grape tomatoes, deodorant that Lily, um, that Lily Bay from Guadi's brand recommended on her Instagram story the other day. Some broccoli, some baked lace chips. Of course, we always have chips in the house. Um, I got some bread for Jonathan. This is his favorite bread. Thin sliced Dave's Killer bread for myself. Kettle cooked flaming hot chips that La Prima Cristal um, recommended on her Instagram story. I had ordered Funyuns, but they didn't have any, so I had to um, replace the item with hot Cheetos, which we don't eat that much. Some Doritos, nacho cheese Doritos for Jonathan. So that's all I got. I'm gonna put all of this away and have lunch. I also express frustration and a message from this person me to not speak to respect her. That is still sharing that because he's a minor. So <laughs> Okay, I'm breaking my fast at 1.34 p.m., which means I can eat up until 8.34 p.m. today. Um, I'm just eating a bagel with cream cheese, a little bit of salt and pepper, and grape tomatoes because I love that. Um, but yeah, this is my breakfast. Well, this is my lunch, brunch. Hey guys, I am ready. I actually put some press-on nails on from Lashed by Andre on Instagram. Um, I am filming that for another video, though, so that's why I didn't film... Um, I didn't feel myself putting them on and I did a little bit of makeup because we are filming a podcast today and I'm about to get started on dinner so I just have peeled and deveined shrimp um, thawing in the sink. I'm going to get started with the rice. We, I just eat regular, I just eat regular schmegler jasmine rice. I actually don't put anything in it except for a pinch of salt. Um, just because I'm trying to be a little bit more mindful of what I'm eating, I am really, really trying to lose some pounds, some quarantine pounds. Um, but yes, so I'm gonna get started on on dinner really quick. Jonathan should be off of work here soon, and we shall be good. It's clear that the doors are closed. Um, especially back then, when I was drinking upwards of like three to four cups a day, often I'm like, oh, uh uh, so. But whatever. She went her thing, and I already knew, like, considered opinions and what to do with all of it. It was just about that I did. It was like a bigger palette cutter. I forget which one actually got pulled in here. While I'm packing up my stuff for her Snapchat, I got you guys, like, look at me started really getting the. All right, dinner is ready. So I have some shrimp broccoli and cauliflower and just some jasmine rice so i'm gonna turn this off now i'm gonna go do my hair now because it looks crazy all right guys it is much later actually we had dinner we went to take ozo out on a little walk and now we also filmed our podcast and now Jonathan is editing. We sort of have a rule that when whoever's editing the podcast gets to ask for whatever they want. So Jonathan requested a cereal. I'm gonna make him a cereal. Fruity Pebbles, babe? Yeah. So let's make him a cereal real quick, boy. Oh, thank you so much. I love the cereal. <laughs> okay, I showed you guys earlier that Ozo was sick, but I never told you what was wrong with him. He's been he's been very sad all day, very mellow and sleeping, taking naps. So basically, the so first time we took him to the vet, he had a feces sample and it came back saying that he had um he had a parasite. Hold on. I came back saying that he had a parasite. Um, I actually want some chips, so I'm gonna talk to you guys while I put some chips in a bowl. That is my last snack of the day. Chips. Balanced diet, period. But, so he has a parasite that's common in puppies, and 
most likely he came with it so sh the vet gave me medication to him to give him orally it was a seven day medication and i just had to give it to him once a day and i did he changed his food because we couldn't get our hands on the food that the breeder was giving him at petco he um you had to order it off of some website so we changed him to another food that was highly recommended to us for puppies and he started having like a little bit of diarrhea so um i took him to the vet on friday may 8th because he had his last rabies shot and then i also told her about the diarrhea and she said let's to do another stool sample to check if it is the food that's causing it or if he's um sick again and it came back positive for giardia again so it is so easy for puppies to reinfect themselves they can maybe step on uh, step on feces and like lick their lick their foot and then that is reinfecting himself or maybe something a little piece of poop was left on his butt and he's trying to clean himself and he reinfected himself again um so we're being pretty cautious about where he poops and picking up the poop and um we also have a appointment on a tuesday to get him showered and groomed and hopefully get a little bit of a haircut because his hair is pretty long um i have showered him three times already since we got him so we're just trying to be very very clean about it but we're kind of sad because today is today he woke up with really 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 runny poop and it is the saddest i've seen him so far so it's been really taking a toll on me because it's so sad like i can't do anything to help and he can't talk to me and tell me that he feels sick or something um I called the doctor today again to give me more medication but she was in surgery and the little the assistant said that she would give her a message but she never got back to me so I'm gonna call again tomorrow and see if there's a way we can get his oral medication and because she did give me like a powdered medication to put on top of his foot on top of his food but he hated it and he did not touch his food at all i don't know if it's because of the medication or because he's just not hungry because giardia can cause like weight loss in a pet which means loss of appetite <sighs> i know that was so long but yeah we're just trying to keep a close eye on him and trying to make him feel better but i'm gonna have some chips now so I ordered Funyuns on Instacart today, but they were out of them at King Supers. So she got me Hot Cheetos as a replacement. I wouldn't say it's the best replacement, but from from this to nothing, it's good. So yeah, I try to be pretty healthy, eat a balanced diet, but I still don't deprive myself from chips or sweets. Um, but yeah, this is going to be my last little snack of the day. It is. 9 p.m. so at 9 30 p.m. i'm done eating until tomorrow at 1 p.m. um but yeah thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video if you did make sure to give it a thumbs up and turn on your post notifications because i know that not a lot not a lot of you guys get the notification that i uploaded or it doesn't show up in your subscription box but yeah if you liked it turn on the bell and yeah without further ado my camera's about to die so i gotta go thank you so much for watching i love you so much i appreciate you so so much and i'll see you in my next video but until then please Please always remember God goes glowing and growing. Dime lo que, dime lo que tú quieres de mi coqueta. Sé lo que te gusta es salir y se suelta. Pango a la reggaeton pa' mí, que muñeca. Me gusta salir y se dosis.